So what made you pick a boxer? Um, they're family dogs, they're loyal dogs, and they're full of energy like me. So I knew this dog, once he's of age, we're gonna be able to get to run and work out together. Nice, nice. I like how goofy and silly they are. He's always <laughs> playing and, and just acting silly like how I am. <laughs> <laughs> good, good, good. They all they always say a dog is a reflection of their owners. So yeah, we got the yeah. athletic fit side yeah, and yeah. the goofy side and you got both with him. <laughs> So what has been the, I guess, the most difficult thing with him so far? Um, I guess just realizing that just because we did the training that one time, he's not going to get it right away. Just knowing you have to be patient, let him, you know, have that repetition until he finally understands it. Yeah, I would say um, yeah, just understanding that he's still uh, right now a puppy and he's not perfect. So we just have to keep being patient and um, just keep uh, running things that you taught us <laughs> <laughs> and have you noticed a different dog from the beginning of training until now oh, yeah for sure yeah. it's getting easier for him to understand what's expected right. um sometimes we expect our dogs to just like you said pick up on things the first time we tell it and some dogs are smart enough too but they're also going to try to cheat and get away with stuff and 